Clara Bart knew adversity long before her battlefield experiences in the Civil War. She became a teacher, establishing and managing a school in Bordentown, New Jersey. Her fundraising efforts enabled the construction of a new building. A male administrator replaced her once the structure was complete. She found her niche during the Civil War, fundraising for medical supplies, aiding soldiers, and nursing them on the front lines. It was dangerous work with no pay. After the war, she established an organization to locate missing soldiers. Her office and residence in Washington, D.C. still remains. Post-war, she was recruited by the International Red Cross to establish an American chapter. After navigating the treacherous political trenches of two presidencies, she finally was successful in establishing an operation. In 1904, her board of directors found her management style unsettling and archaic. She was forced to resign from the organization that she had founded.